We came here to catch a bass. An open lake, fresh water, beautiful setting and a beautiful day to catch such a beautiful creature. We arrived early and just on time. However, to catch a bass, a largemouth bass, would take more than just timing. It would take skill and hard work to find it. We started off by trying to catch a sunfish. We would use the sunfish as bait to try and later catch the largemouth bass. However, catching such a tiny fish is not as easy as a task as one might think it is. We used a little worm to catch the sunfish and jerked it constantly to try to catch its attention. However, the sunfish was very hard to hook with such a small mouth. We tried over and over again to catch the sunfish. Our patience was getting run out and we were starting to get annoyed. However, we realized that the sunfish would serve as perfect bait for the large mouth, so we kept trying. Eventually, we set up another hook with a popper this time to try and catch a large mouth while we tried to catch a sunfish. Hopefully, it could get us results. We fished and fished and fished. The popper was not attracting any attention, and there were no bass in the nearby area. See why I like this place? Now, this happens, like you can see them like this, with freaking six pounders. Bass this big. Decided to move location and headed more to the left side of that lake. We snuck in through the woods to try and find a good spot. Hopefully the sunfish would be here. It was very slippery and as a matter of fact, I almost fell. Cool, really slippery. See that? Almost dropped the camera. I'm losing my balance, bro. Yeah, that thing's in the water. Like was so vast and on such a sunny day, we thought there has to be a largemouth bass. It was springtime and these were pretty shallow waters where the largemouth bass likes to go and feed. Eventually, we caught a sunfish and we knew we could use it as bait now. The largemouth bass could start to come in. Hang on. All right, just keep it in the water, Elijah. First catch of the day. He's way too big for bait. We tried a different spot to use the sunfish and try to catch a largemouth bass. However, we were still not getting in results with a popper and with the sunfish. So once again, we tried a different location. This time on a more eastern side of the lake. We snuck in through a small narrow path in the woods once again as we searched for the largemouth predator of the freshwater lakes. First catch of the season. Second catch of the season. <sighs> Focus. Anything to say? After lots of searching, we finally came up to a spot and caught ourselves our first bass. However, its size proved to most likely be a smallmouth bass, and if it was a largemouth, 
It wouldn't be the fish that we wanted. We wanted to catch something bigger. However, the fish soon escaped our grasp. Unfished. Unfished. But the water seemed too calm for any sight of a largemouth bass. Until suddenly, we had finally caught one, a decent sized largemouth bass. This one we knew we could get on camera. She's a fighter. I'm pretty badly hooked too. That's why he's freaking out. Oh yeah, look. After releasing the hook, I was able to get good footage of it. Our large mouth bass. And release. Because we don't catch all of from the kick. Because we don't use all of from the kick. Go, come on, come on, hit me. Hit me. Hit me. There you go. That's what you gotta always wait for. Why? Because that. 